Welcome back to Great Day Washington. May is Military Appreciation Month, and every Monday this month, we are going to highlight an organization helping the military community. Today, we want to talk about Operation Homefront. It is a nonprofit organization that focuses on helping military families. Well, joining us today to tell us more, we have the Chief Revenue Officer, Margie Kirst, and also Army Specialist Deontay Early. Welcome to both of you. Thank, Thank you for you. having us. Oh, absolutely. Thank you for being here in this month and all that you do for our military families. Let's start with what is your organization? So what does Operation Homefront even do? So we are a national nonprofit, and our mission is to build strong, stable, and secure military families. And we do that because we want them to thrive and not struggle to get by in the mm -hmm. communities that they've worked so hard to protect. Yeah, I'm sure you see a lot of struggles like that that we don't even realize are happening. That's correct. So uh, these days, a lot of Americans are struggling with high housing prices mm -hmm. and inflation and all those things. Well, yeah. so are military families. And on top of that, you may have deployments, you may have moves mm -hmm. every two years, mm -hmm. and then when you tr transition out of the military, often military families face a long time to get their last paycheck and their VA benefits, and this can start a mm -hmm. cycle of short-term crises that could end up mm -hmm. to be long-term wow. struggles. If you don't take care, of it, don't take care of it right yeah. away. You have a new campaign that begins we today, do. right? So this is called United We Stand, Meet America's Military Families. What, what is this campaign about? So our United We Stand campaign writ large is about inviting Americans who, in this great nation, we are very supportive of our military, but today, 1% of Americans actually serve in the military. Mm. And so what we want, but we, we know that 99% really want to support military families like the yeah. earlys and many others. So yeah. it's a call to action. And in May, um, what we want to do is introduce military families and their stories to mm. Americans because what I find is not, not everybody knows the struggles um, mm -hmm. and the changes and the challenges. And we want to profile uh, families like Deontay and his yeah. family to show not only what they live through, but how they overcome it. Yeah, the whole reason you're here, Deontay, yes. right? Yes, ma'am. Thank you for your service, first uh, of all. Thank you for the support. What has it been like for you? What, what kind of has this journey been like? Um, it's uh, in Operation Homefront has definitely helped. Um, mm -hmm. They help me with, uh, they do like credit monitoring every month to prepare you for housing um, once you do exit the program. So it's been, um, it, while in Operation Homefront, it's been very easy and, and smooth. Yeah. So. Did it take years to get to through the program, or what is it like for maybe someone who's wondering, like, okay, do I sign up now? How do I? Yes, sign navigate? up now. Okay. Yes, definitely <laughs> sign up now. Right now. Um, I started actually in February of last year. Um, okay. They give you 16 to 18 months. Uh, they monitor you, like I said, they also help you with savings. Um, so you're better and you're able to prepare yourself once you do exit the program. So um, it's a, been about a year, almost a year and a half. Um, so it's not that long. Okay. Uh, you just have to stay disciplined. Is it like the support for the mil military families? Do you find that it, it's lacking out there? Is this a program that's rare? That Definitely. You can go to. Mm -hmm. I think it's lacking. I think also um, knowledge. Um, mm -hmm. Spread the word. That's the the main thing. Uh, a lot of people don't know about Operation Homefront, which is yeah. a very great great program. Um, I think just if more people knew about it, then they will also sign up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And can people sign up, Marky? How does that work? Absolutely. So they can okay. find all the information about us on OperationHomefront.org. And depending on, that, you can go to our programs page if you're a military family. We not only offer housing, transitional housing, but also critical financial assistance, so short-term grants. If you're, say, three months behind in your mortgage or your rent, we can help you out if you're eligible. And then every year we do um, hundreds of events around the country, back to school brigades, holiday meals, mm -hmm. just to help military families get by, but also know we support them. And that sounds like some fun things in there. Oh, There's yeah. lots of fun things like, oh, going yes. over your finances. A lot of, a lot of fun things. <laughs> What's yes. been your favorite fun thing? Can we tell everybody? Um, I believe it's like the cookouts and the camaraderie okay. between uh, other like military personnel that's in the program. Yeah. Um, I definitely talk to a lot of other people that, that are in the program personally. Uh, you have personal daycares if you want to you mm. know, take your spouse out or anything. Um, but yeah. It's just the camaraderie and the, yeah. the togetherness. That's, That's what you're used to, yes. too, right, for yes. the military? It's like yeah. one big family, so e exactly. I'm sure that helps. Yes. Well, thank you for sharing your story. Thank yes. you for everything that you're doing and for being here today. Um, if you want to get involved at home, you can go over to operationhomefront.org and you'll learn everything there.